cargo hardpoint, and uh, I'm going to try to keep up with you all, but you know what? This is so fast-paced. Let's put my podcasting skills to the test. It's going to be so tough, and you'll see it immediately. We're going to take an overhead map view as we see the breakout, and there you go. Look how close these teams are to each other right off the spawn. Great, great map, and there it is right in the office building, and look at that push from the North Americans, and there you have it. They set themselves up for it. Nice. Throwing a frag over the top of the building, and now we're on board with the Europeans. It's going to be Raiden. However, the North Americans do get onto that hard point. We'll take a look at the picture in picture. You see that Merc and Ray are located on that hard point right now as Ray picking up a huge double kill right there. Very nice hip fire, and you hear the crowd giving a round of applause for that move. And now Ray is just bouncing around, dodging all sorts of grenades. And look at that skill out of Ray of Optic Gaming. And now we're on board with Toby for the North Americans, picking up a nice two-piece as well. Two big kills right there. The North Americans were able to push their whole team into this hard point. And it looks like Toby has secured some score streaks here. He's got a UAV, counter UAV, very nice two-piece there as well. And you see that Toby doesn't have a secondary equip. So when he swapped over to a secondary, he had the combat knife. So he decided to go ahead and leave the secondary out of play in this particular class. And he sacrificed that for something else. And now he's going to go ahead and toss out a hunter killer drone. And now he's going to call in a UAV as well as Quantum comes in. Didn't even know Toby was still remaining. So Toby on a kill streak here. He has six in a row. You see that his teammate Ray on the picture in picture is on the hard point. Now Toby is going to play this safe. Calls in another hunter killer drone here. He's going to throw that out. He's picking up UAV assist as well. And so he does have that care package coming in and he has secured yet another. So he gets a guardian turret there with that care package. So Toby now making moves. The action is across the map. As you see one player there getting taken out. Those UAV assists racking up for him right now. He does have another care package, but he's going to decide not to call that in, but he's going to run into a flurry of European players here. You, you, again, Toby now turning the corner. Toby is actually European himself, filling in, and look at this! Comes upon three players, could have had a massive play, but he decided the hit fire just didn't work out for him, and he's going to call in this Guardian turret. He's going to think otherwise of positioning here, and it looks like he's going to put it here on this staircase, and look at that positioning. That is going to be a very, very good position for that Guardian turret. No Europeans are coming up that back staircase. I guarantee you that. And look at this. He's just going to wait here and lock down this position. He does have that other care package, so we're still on board with Toby with the MSMC at the moment. And it looks like the hard point has been contested. However, two more teammates for Toby have secured that. And it looks like the North Americans are just doing an amazing job right now as they have the lead, 97 to 29. However, the Europeans do manage to get onto that hard point via the opposite side of where Toby put his Guardian turret. And he's trying to call in that care package. And right now you see care packages abound dropping for the North Americans. So it looks like they are all using the care package score streak. And there's a UAV that comes in. And now Toby making moves. He's going to go down and let's jump on board with Raiden for the Europeans who is now on a four kill streak. And Shane going massive with a lightning strike. Picking up a quad feed right there. Let's jump on board with Shane. He picked up that huge quad, and that allowed the Europeans to secure the office here. And let's see what Shane can do. But Shane gets picked off from behind as one of the North Americans climbed through the window. And now we're still on board with Shane. As you see, it's going to be a massive gun battle here in the office. And look at that shot by Shane. Just Oh my goodness, just decimating the North Americans with a nice two-piece there. What a shot that was with the hip. And he does have a care package as well. Uh, let's take a look here. Looks like all of the North Americans are on the objective here. Extending their lead now. Two minutes remaining. Why don't we take a listen in and hear just what they're saying. Middle map, middle map. We got top, we got top, two, two, two up top, two up top. Ah, uh, he's, he's haggling to Ray below it. I got hated. Up behind us. Yo, on the hard point, on the hard point. Stand up top, or behind us, or 
I actually don't know where. Uh, uh left side. All right, so you heard North Americans. They're actually relatively quiet, in my opinion. They did have some good communication there. We heard Toby early on making a few good call-outs to kick off that communication for the team as Merck now calling in a care package as well. We've seen a lot of players using care packages here on cargo, and it's, it's just really interesting to watch. You get a bunch of these score streak drops coming in, and they do really help your team here on hardpoint as a hunter killer drone is out, and look at that. Merck tosses out that hunter killer drone right before he takes the death and then immediately just took a face off. And now you see 30 seconds left to go in this hard point, 149 to 100. And it looks like the Europeans actually have been mathematically eliminated because there just aren't enough seconds left in the game for them to come back. But we see that they are trying to actually jump on that objective and keep the score as close as possible. Hats off to these European players right now. 13 seconds left to go. Looks like Gunchy here is still looking for blood, and he spots it in Merck. Takes out Merck, five seconds left, and the North American side is going to take this hard point. And let's see your final score, 149 to 127. And let's take a look at the final kill cam. Oh, look at Optic Gaming with a little bit of a celebration. And look at Optic Ray with two lethal grenades. Grenades flying everywhere on the kill cam and Ray getting your final kill. And we'll have one more hard point coming up for you.